So what makes me think that the Sheridan isn't instantly a great tank? Well, let's talk about the gun. If a tank can't properly shoot another tank, can it even be called a tank? Yes. The M551 is a light tank with a gun missile launcher system placed firmly at 8.0. The Sheridan can lob three different types of shells, high explosive, heat, and ATGM. The guided missiles are really the star of the show, because this is the first tank in the US tech tray that can use them. Unfortunately, the ATGM has to be unlocked in the modifications, leaving you with only heat and high explosive. And, according to my good friend the stat card, the heat round is obviously better. This is in fact wrong. The heat round is extremely unreliable, and it kinda sucks. Borderline useless, in fact. The post pain damage is little to none. On the other hand, the high explosive round is just unreliable and okay. Huge improvement. Anything under 35 tons will get completely destroyed by the incredible post pen damage from the high explosive shell. The post pen damaging effects only take effect post pen, and according to my good friend, the pen sucks. But forget that guy, he lied about the heat round. I find that shooting under or on top of a tank usually works. The ATGM takes the best of both worlds and combines them into just being unreliable. The pen is eh, good and the post pen damage is yeah, okay, yeah, missiles. Now, I know what you're thinking. Who cares about post pain damage? The Sheridan cares. If you were to shoot a tank and kill its engine and the commander, you'd be dead. If you shoot a tank and all you kill is the commander and the gunner, you're still dead. If you shoot at a tank and get the commander, gunner, and the loader, you still might die. The reload time, the paper thin armor, and the Pentagon's 200 IQ ammo storage placement gets this thing demolished and quite literally murdered 9 times out of 10. All of the shells are unreliable too. Did you miss that? Did I forget to mention that little detail? All of this isn't even mentioning that any sort of map debris or obstacle or leaf completely defeats the Sheridan. Every time you want to mouse one a BMP, will I aim? Bounce. B. Disable nothing in the tank. C. Hit a tree branch. Or D. Completely miss. If there is a tank that has a little bit of armor, more than three crewmen, and knows where you are, there is no way you can make it out of there alive. You have smokes, you have a stabilizer, you have great mobility, and damn it if you don't have your commander's 50 cal given to you by the man himself, the Sheridan is still a chore to play. But when you get that kill, that kill that makes the tanks turn slam dunk that bush 20 feet to the left, you know you've just got to do that again. <laughs> 